in a world where the survivors are actually the killer. And the killer is just trying to survive. One Bam Bam is going to devour all of their soap. Hey, listen! So the name of the game today. We are going to get four moris, five stacks, devour hope on everybody. Using only devour hope and throw the hunt. We're using throw the hunt just so, you know, I actually have a chance. But we're also using add-ons too. Just, you know what? Fuck you, like. So we're using, in my opinion, Bam Bam's best add-ons. And this is why I have a blackboard because I don't have a lot of them because I like to run them a lot. We're gonna get all four people Mori in this game and then throw the hunt so that we can protect our Devour Hope and our Thrill the Hunt. We get notifications so that we can see if anyone touches the totem. This is what we're doing. I hope you guys enjoy. Leave a like, comment, subscribe. Do all that good shit. And if you don't, Bam Bam's gonna annihilate the booty hole. And you wouldn't want that. You probably would. I'm not gonna lie. You probably would. Just stating facts. Going in with only Devour and Thrill on Batum 3. Well, Batum 3 actually isn't a good or a, a bad killer map. But it's not the best map that you can possibly get for killer for Batum. There's plenty of things that could go wrong with this. One of them being that I can't... Oh, the totems are actually decently close. I could deal with that. Little shit. <laughs> you little shit! I'm just gonna let him drop it. Get rid of this pallet. Don't really care about it. We have our power, so the second someone tries to go after one of those totems, I'm flying at them. I'll take that pallet! That was such a weird one, holy shit! I couldn't see anything! really not a lot to do right now don't pick him off the hook oh, now you can't never mind Oh, you best believe I'm getting that ass. Don't touch that shit. 
You best get off my boy over there. Oh, you got... We'll make it. Nice. Don't get hit. I said don't get hit. Why does man's on my totem? Well, there's the Mori. You gotta love it. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna fuck you up. Told you I'ma fuck you up. Oh, you're so lucky! Ah! Oh. What's the point of that? Well, there goes him. In a world where Bam Bam is actually your father and he gives you the dickens every day. We have to hit people, we have to save our um our build <laughs> They're decently close, so that's not too bad. We have to save our ability so that when someone touches the totem, we use it and fly back to them. Pretty sure I just saw someone in there. Ah. Whew. We have to save our ability. Whenever we're chasing someone and someone touches the totem, we have to f we have to go right back to it. This totem's decent. The other totem sucks. She's just going. She's just running around the outside. I'll take that. I should have my ability. Okay, you didn't even realize what I was doing.
That's the only time I was touching, or I, I was using my ability. Because I had to, or else he would have just got out anyway. It would have been a waste of blood. Alright, we, we got two tokens. Let's see if you have decisive. I can waste it. I can get it gone. I guess you don't have decisive. Oh, fuck. I went the wrong way. Well, I don't want to pick you, or I don't want to get you anyway. Hi. You want to do? You want to do the same thing? Probably could have used the ability. I'll take that pallet. He's back up. Let's see if this person has. Wait, did I? I I hooked this person, but I don't think they would have it still. We got a lot of blood around, so we're gonna leave it. We're not gonna use our ability. We're gonna keep it, because in the next save, we're gonna have our devour hope. They know I have Devour Hope because it activates off of anything. We're in a really good spot right now. There's not a lot they can do. Hi. All right, we can get this person on the hook. Oh, nice. I have no problem pulling you out of the damn block, god damn it! Someone save him. Fuck yes. This is where it starts. Oh, you better fucking run. I I I will I will beat that ass. That was so weird. Why did it do that? <laughs> I barely even heard it. All right, this is where the Mori comes in. Let's get this four-person Devour Soap Mori with only Thrill of the Hunt and add-ons. You, you gotta use add-ons. It's kind of, you know, you have to use add-ons. Oh, there you are. Don't touch the totem, please! I can't deactivate my power, which sucks, and I'm pretty sure it deactivates after the Mori's done. Or it doesn't. That's actually decent. This other person jumped out the window. 
Yeah, I'm not gonna let you get that. Not how this shit works. <laughs> I don't know what's wrong with these potatoes. I wasn't just gonna let you get that totem just because I downed him. You should have started it as I done the Mori. Please don't spawn inside of the house. You little shit! Give me my foreman! Give me my damn foreman! No! I deserve it! I got fucking Lampkin Lane. The totem spots are really good. But I got Lampkin Lane. Using two perks. My add-ons. I deserve it. Give it to me. Shut up about my daily rituals. I don't want to get them. Oh, yeah. And by the way. April Fools, you filthy animals. I'm just all about this money. I don't think about no thighs. No Girl, you don't know about me. So get off my fucking D. Born and raised in the thigh. This is real as you gon' see. Girl, you don't know about me. So get off my fucking D.